Hey everyone, it's Calvin here. Uh, I'm going to show you how to import songs into our library if they're not there. Uh, rather than creating the song from scratch and doing that whole thing, there's actually a little shortcut that we can use here. If uh, Let's pretend that today we are going to, uh, one of the songs is going to be Oh Praise Him by David Crowder. And obviously here in my little library, it's not there, so I can't drag that into my playlist. Uh, we're going to go here to Song Select. When you click on that, uh, the program comes up, and um, all you do is you go here to Song Search, and you just type in the name of the song, and then you click on Search. Here's the song right here, and uh, we're going to go to the Lyrics button right here. And here's all the words for the song, so we don't have to type it now. It's all here for us to import into our library. So to import it, you just take your mouse and you just highlight or uh, bring it over the lyrics button here. Go down to copy or save, click on that. Box is going to come up and ask you different options. Um, I just leave it on import into currently selected playlist. And most importantly, you want to leave it on paragraph break. If you select single line return, that's going to put each sentence into its own box. And you're going to have, I don't know how many sentences there are in this song, but probably going to be a lot of them. So if you leave it at paragraph break, it's going to import this course into one box, this verse into one box, so on and so forth. Let's hit continue. And right there, it's now in our playlist. And let me get rid of this box here. It's now in our library too. So if you want to do more songs that, that you need and aren't in the library, you can just go back here to Song Search and put in a new song. And once you're finished importing, you just go here to this X, click on that, and you're back to the presentation area. And let's click on Oh Praise Him, and there is our lyrics. Very quick, great program to have. Now as a side note here, when I look at this, verse 1 and verse 2, there's a lot of words there probably more than what we want to have just in one box. So as a side note, I'm going to I'm going to split up a verse here really quick. I'm going to take this blank box, hold down the Apple button on the keyboard, which is to the left of the space bar, and I'm going to take my mouse and I'm going to click on it and drag it over to right there. That's going to put that blank box right there. I do that because for every song, I like to have a video background before the words, just as kind of our own little intro into the song. So I'm going to take this little background, drag it into the box, same process for dragging anything. You hold down the Apple button, take your mouse, click on it, drag it right into the box, and there it is. So that way now when I click on it, we're going to see that on the screen first. So let's, uh, let's, let's get rid of that there. Uh, back to verse 2. Okay. I want to put an empty box right here so I can take part of these words and drag them into this one. So to add a new box, you just go down here to plus and there's, there's a new box. Um, I'm going to drag that next to verse 2 just to kind of simplify it. Um, now I'm ready to edit these words. So I'm going to go down here to edit and uh, here's verse 2. I'm going to click on that. Here's all of our words. Double click anywhere on the words and that opens up the, the text edit pro program. Uh, and I'm going to, uh, let's see here, I'm going to go ahead and take this part of the song, select that, right click, hit cut. There's a little space right here, I want to get rid of that. I'm going to press the backspace button as we know it in the Windows world. Uh, in the Mac world it's, it says delete, but uh, that gets rid of that. Now I'm going to go here to box number five, double click on text, right click, hit paste, there's the rest of that song. I'm all done editing, I'm going to hit done, and now you can see here the two, uh, uh, this, this verse that I've split up now into um, a little bit more uniform. And, and actually I would do the same thing with uh, verse one too, so I'm going to just do this really quick here, drag this here. Let's go to edit, uh, verse 1, and let's select this, cut, and do a little backspace, put this here, double click, right click, hit paste, 
all done. Now we're looking a little bit better there. So anyways, I hope that helps. Thanks for listening and we'll talk to you.